Cognitive stimulation is essentially the engagement in a range of activities that force you to use your brain. And large multi-center, multi-participant control trials have indicated that it is one of the most effective and cost-effective ways to improve and retain cognitive capacity throughout your entire life and reduce the risk of neurodegenerative diseases. So let's talk about some of the easiest ways to preserve cognitive function. Actively traveling appears to reduce the risk of mild cognitive impairment. Cognitive stimulation such as intellectual activities like a crossword puzzle, reading, watching TV, listening to the radio, playing games, puzzling, or even gambling is associated with a reduced risk of cognitive decline later in life. It appears that postponing retirement is one of the easiest ways to reduce the risk of mild dementia and cognitive decline. Meaning even if you're not working for the money and you're doing something you've always wanted to do but don't need to do, delaying the age at which you retire and maintaining some daily workplace activity and structure may be one of the easiest ways to postpone or even prevent the development of cognitive decline and many depressive symptoms often seen after retirement. Actively participating and engaging in art-like activity like coloring, drawing, or other arts, engaging in and maintaining a garden, dancing, physical exercise, and learning a language are also examples of cognitively stimulating activities that can preserve cognitive function as we get older. And to both preserve cognitive function and preserve quality of life, Higher social participation can also be an extremely vital component. There are many other things like watching your children, babysitting, playing a sport, or even trying to learn something new such as science or history, which can all help to preserve cognitive function, improve cognitive capacity, and delay the risk of memory loss and other cognitive impairments as we age. And it appears that if you can do this within a community and engage with other individuals, you can also maintain emotional well-being.